Hi guys, today I wanted to show you how I check my uh, glucose reading levels every day. Um, I have this, which is called the Freestyle Libre. Um, it looks, ooh, the light. It looks like this little sensor right here. I can kind of show you uh, when I unbox it, but normally when people have diabetes, my first fear when they told me was that I'm gonna have to sick myself every day, multiple times a day. Um, so I just wouldn't do it. I wouldn't I would skip a day if I was feeling bad then maybe I would do it but like It was just Anxiety for me and pretty soon I did get over the anxiety But if you're having a lot of trouble like dreading to do it um, to poke yourself every day on your fingers or your fingers just hurt or you um, I found that some people use their hands a lot and it really hurts um when you're when you're typing or if you're doing an instrument or you just really use your hands to work um, your fingers do get pretty sore even if you use the other one or you use this hand kind of thing um, I always gravitated to using this one finger right here and for a while um, it was actually just it just really hurt and so my doctor did recommend the freestyle Libre so I looked into it um, my insurance did not cover the freestyle libre they're about $40 um, a sensor without insurance um, my insurance did not cover it but some patients have gotten their doctors to write that they need to um, read their glucose multiple times I think it's like five plus times a day for um, certain insurances to cover it um, so it is $80 this is what it looks like This is the box that it comes in. I opened it. Um, I'll kind of show you what and how to put it on. So it comes in something like this. I don't know how to do this. Uh, there you go. I wish this light wasn't so harsh. So this is what it looks like. It's a little canister right here. And this is the sensor. And then if you see right here, this is the second part of it. So it has two pieces. You unscrew this one. And there's a little notch right here that they want you to guide right here in the center. So it tells you a lot in the little information thing. I'm kind of familiar, I'm very familiar with it actually. Um, so this line right here and then this piece right here is supposed to line up and it does. And then you just kind of go down, okay? What you heard was just the sensor from here going into here, okay? Now if you look at it, you can kind of see there. You can kind of see the needle. Um, don't be scared of the needle. It is just a, a guide. Um, so the needle does shoot in <laughs> into your arm. It is scary, but it does shoot into your arm. You don't feel it. Um, I don't feel it. Sometimes if I, if I do it wrong, then yes, you'll kind of hit something, but I really don't feel it. Majority of the time I did it once that I didn't feel that it was right. Um, and I was just a little bit uncomfortable for two weeks and then I took it out. But if you are uncomfortable with it, you can always call the manufacturer and the manufacturer will send you a new one and they'll request the old one back from you because the manufacturer wants you to be happy. Um, I alternate between days. So I do have little markings here. So this happens when you do it repeatedly on the same arm. So what you're gonna want is to rotate arms. See, I have one here, but it's not as bad. So what I do is two weeks I'll have it on this arm, and then the next two weeks I'll have it on this arm. Uh, what you're gonna wanna do, I hold my head, and then I just kinda have this little piece right here facing there, 
and I'll guide it in the center. You will feel the needle right there just a little bit. And then once it goes in, it goes in so fast and the needle springs back so fast. So it's kind of like a guided tube that just goes in. So we're gonna do this. Ah! And I'm always like very nervous, <laughs> even though it doesn't hurt. Oh. Okay, ready? Try to find the right area. One, two. There it goes. I made a face, but it didn't hurt. Um, so it's stuck on there. This is how big it is. And it just kind of stays there. You're going to want to scan it with your phone. You upload the app, you scan it with your phone. Um, the needle is inside there. So it's way down deep inside here. And then the little tube is inside there. Kind of like a, um, what do you call it? A little IV. So the little IV is in there for you. Um, and you don't can just kind of cover it up put it in here throw it away um, I usually take a shower right before which I did um, I take a shower um, but if you haven't taken a shower or anything like that just um, they give you some alcohol prep pads to use um, so do the alcohol prep pad then you put it on that's it Thanks for watching.